Hi, this is Faris and welcome back to another quick Photoshop tutorial and today I'll show you how to create that beautiful cinematic film halogen effect in a super simple way. So let's get it started. Okay, first copy the layer by pressing command and Z and then convert it to a smart object. Now, go to image adjustment and threshold. And now play with the value according to your image. Actually, this defines where the halogen glow will appear. Okay. Okay, I think it looks fine and hit OK when you are happy. Now head over to filter, blur, and hit Gaussian blur. And increase the radius value to get a soft glow effect. Let's go with 45 pixel for this image. As it is a smart object, you can always double click and change the value later. So hit OK. And change the blend mode to screen. You will now see a soft dreamy glow kicking in. But we want more. We want more cinematic effect. So create a solid color adjustment layer and let's go with orange -ish or a red color and now clip this one to layer one so right click and here you will find create clipping mask and now change the blend mode to overlay or soft light let's go with soft light for this image you can uh, decrease the opacity or increase the opacity from here and you can also change the color easily so you can go with the red color or the orange color or you can experiment with any color you want now look at this and now we want to add some noise to make it more vintage or cinematic so for this go to the layer new layer and here let's go to the mode to overlay and take fill with 50 percent gray opacity 100 percent hit ok and then convert this layer to smart object then go to filter noise and add noise and increase the amount to get that subtle film texture so let's go with 25 percent keep that in monochromatic and hit ok so that's it look at this this was the before and this is after it looks really great it looks dreamy it looks cinematic and it looks really cool right and the best part you will get this effect as an action the link is on the video description and it's totally free just download and load it into your photoshop and then hit the play button just like this and set the value according to your image and it's done look at this it's done so it's super easy and you can achieve this by just one click don't forget to support me on my patreon the link is on the video description and that's it i hope you love this video if you did, hit the like button leave your comments and don't forget to subscribe